so this project, it's a, a really unique project. It uh, has the purpose of protecting habitat for a rare species. Interstate Island is one of two locations in uh, the Lake Superior watershed where common terns nest. And they're vulnerable to predation and to development in their habitat. So this is basically where two thirds of all of the terns uh, in the upper Great Lakes nest. The island is, as the water level in the estuary comes up, the island is shrinking pretty dramatically. If you look at all the aerial photos, you can see year over year, this island is getting smaller and smaller. And it's just because of those water elevations, it's flooding. So the common terns are inhabiting Interstate Island with a whole colony of ring-billed gulls and some herring gulls. And at the current time, because of the area is so flooded, there's too much pressure from all the gulls living on the island and they're actually eating baby turn chicks. This project will involve raising the, the nesting colony, the managed portion of the island where the terns are nesting so that it's at a safe elevation for them, as well as filling some of the flooded areas internal to the island. Our plan then is to actually do a, um, an expansion of the island to enable us to achieve five and a half acres of stable upland habitat above our design high water level. So the design in this case is um, thinking about what our sustainable slopes for the island that aren't going to erode, but are also going to be appropriate for the birds. Um, what is an appropriate footprint for the island. Um, you know, there are trade-offs between the size of the island and the likely stability of the island, depending on how big and where. A project like this is really wonderful because it's an on-the-ground demonstration of how you can make a big difference, in this case, for a special species of birds. <laughs>